The SCR League's first ever season has just been completed. It was a roller coaster of a season. It had the stuff you'd want in a good season and the stuff you'd see in a bad season. Great racing, crazy finishes, controversy, and some spectacular, wild, crazy, unimaginable, all of the above wrecks. Today I will be going over the top 10 wrecks in the first SEAR season. Many help starting off our list, we got a wreck from the very own Clark 300, a race that held host to possibly 15 wrecks. One of those 15 wrecks was Dolph Ziggler flipping over a curb and getting hit by at least three other cars. Paul gets turned into the inside wall, doesn't get flipped. Everyone's turning. That's how does that four people no, spawn? Dolph, so Dolph, Dolph hit by multiple people. Wow. Coming in number nine, we got another wreck from the Clark 300. Genzo and fourth gear transmission were racing side by side in turn three and turns four until fourth gear went up the track a little bit and Genzo happened to be there and hooked him into the wall. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Oh, that means that means Joel goes a lap down, right? Coming in number three eight, we got a wreck three. from the very own the Daytona 75. This was one of the most popular wrecks, maybe even the, the most popular wreck from that race. Basically, coming out of the tri -oval, I'm a blueberry yeet we gets turned by the 31 into the exit of the road course. 83 one on the inside. 95 into the oh man! Huge wreck for the 95. Coming in number seven, we got Genzo's crazy outside wall hit slash side blowover. And in number six, we got a secondary race wreck, where end of dock and in the two gets turned by the 43 and does a crazy flip. Unfortunately, this four second video is all we got of this wreck. Coming in number five, we got a secondary race wreck yet again. It's from the same race the last wreck was in. This was coming to the finish. We got a battle for second. It was. Xenoplex YT versus Joel Musa. Joel Musa hops up onto Xeno and yeah. The reason why this wreck is higher up on the list than the last wreck is because this wreck looks like what happened to Ryan Newman earlier this year at the Daytona 500. In number four we got another wreck from the I'm Daytona 75. Not, Here we have Genzo racing against Michigan Diecast. Genzo gets a big run and isn't able to control it coming off of turn two. He ends up sliding down to the inside and gets turned by Michigan Diecast into the wall. Oh, there's a flip! Oh, massive flip by the 83! Oh, caution. Uh, in number three, we got a wreck under oh, caution. Oh, After the stage oh, one oh, finish oh, at the Clark oh, 300, the cars head back to the pits for restarts. For some reason, they go four wide into turn four, and it ends up into three people flipping. Yeah, I think that can last you, uh, caution. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh! Apparently, I forgot to put this crash in my Clark 300 video. Dude, why? In number two, we have a crazy right. flip big one, as I don't think you're gonna make. Two cars get turned below the WO oh, line gosh. and flip, involving outside. at least five people. To the inside. Oh, oh. Jelly gets oh, hooked. Oh my no, gosh, are you no, kidding no, me? Jesus that's a big, oh, that's a big one. Oh gosh, Dude, can you what? like... What? 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 And the worst wreck in this SCR season is the big one. And I mean the big one because it involved the whole field. Basically, they go into the trial of turning everyone, and it ends up into the 43 being hooked by the 83, going across the field, and... Yeah. 
Here with another view and in slow-mo, you can see the 78 goes up to the 83, gives him a shove, while the 95 is being turned by the 10, the 24 is also being turned by the 95, they hit the 43 and the 83, the 83 gets hooked to the 43's bumper and across the field they go. You can see the 31 being turned as well, 31 almost does a blowover, the 24 goes on top of the 83, surprisingly no one flipped. I had three honor roll mentions, but this is the one that should really be shown. So, I'm a Blueberry Yeet wins the Ice Kingdom 60 kilometers, and after that, Dolph Ziggler dives down to the inside and ends up slamming into Blue uh, in turn one. So, that was the top 10 list, including that one honor roll mentioned. Thanks for watching, and I might do this next season.